The children, they know me as the bag woman. That's what they call me. We give them a bag of groceries for them to eat on the weekends. They don't know that I work for a church. They just know me every Friday morning coming into their classroom and giving them thumbs up and smiling at them. Congregations for Children, which we abbreviate C4C, is an initiative that began back in 2013 as a way to get our churches more engaged with local schools. We looked in our community and we looked at the school down the street. It's East Lawn Elementary. From the first day of school, we're present. We will put a red carpet down for the children and we have signs and balloons and we cheer for them as they get off the school bus and they come into the school. We fill their supply closet up with what their needs are. Clothes and the supplies that the teachers need and the children need daily. We serve 100 turkeys to 100 families at Thanksgiving. All through the Old Testament and even in the New, um, children are regarded as a, a vulnerable population. It very much is one of those red yarns that runs throughout all of Scripture. And if that's what Jesus does, and if, if He believes that, that's, um, that they are an important part of our community, then of course that's, we don't have a choice but to do that. Children, I just think children are the best thing in the world. And working with them daily is definitely a gift that God has given me. We don't go in there and preach the Word of God, but we do go in there and show them our love. And that's all that those children need, is to be loved. Methodists throughout history since the 1700s have been known for opening schools. There's this particularly interesting point in, um, in Methodist history when John Wesley, the founder, received a letter from one of his preachers saying that he had no gifts for serving children. Uh, to which John Wesley replied that, you know, you have, I'm paraphrasing here, you have no business being a Methodist if you're not interested in teaching and preaching to children. Thank you.